Will Hyundai in Montgomery be the next Alabama car factory to possibly join the UAW? A vote to unionize at Alabama's Mercedes plants got underway today in Vance. Tonight, a group of Hyundai workers joined in Montgomery with activists to encourage a similar vote here to join the United Auto Workers. WSFA 12 News reporter Simon Schusler has the story. Activist Reverend Dr. William Barber with the Poor People's Campaign rallied the crowd at what's called a Moral Monday mass meeting in Montgomery, hoping to convince workers at Montgomery's Hyundai plant to unionize. Right now, workers are looking for a way to make sure that they can afford to raise a family, to buy a house, to buy the goods that they produce in the case of auto workers. Robert Strozer has worked at the plant since it opened in 2005. He says a major problem workers see is a lack of accommodation for illness and injury. Sometimes you get injured, you got to come back soon. And really, if you get sick, you ain't got but three persons a day to really work with the whole year. Many criticize unionization efforts, including Alabama Governor Kay Ivey. She signed legislation that will take away economic incentives for companies that voluntarily recognize unions or do not hold secret ballot elections. She does not know the hardworking um, people in her community. She does not know what it's like to feed a family off of $17 an hour or less. Yeah, I reached out to Hyundai Motor Manufacturing Alabama. They said in part that they're providing factual and balanced information about union representation and that team members may choice, choose to join a union or not as their legal right. Mark. All right, Simon, thank you. According to the UAW, 30% of workers at the Hyundai plant have signed a petition showing interest in the union. A Volkswagen plant in Chattanooga just unionized three weeks ago.